The natural gas compressor station near Golenyov in the West Pomeranian Voivodeship is one of three pumping stations that will distribute gas throughout the country. It was here that the opening ceremony of the Baltic Pipe Gas Pipeline, which will begin transporting gas to Poland in just four days, was held. The ceremony was attended by Polish President Andrzej Duda, Prime Minister Mateusz Morawiecki, Prime Minister of Denmark and Norway's Minister of Gas and Energy, among others. Thanks to all these investments and also thanks to the foresight of Polish President Professor Lech Kaczynski, the initiator of the construction of the gas port in Świnoujście, and also a great advocate of this gas connection, we have a gas port today. Few people expected that this investment could be completed on time. I myself had a huge number of doubts. After all, you know, it is not necessary to tell anyone out loud here today how many potential opponents and how much opposition this investment had, how many interests against this investment converged along its route. With an annual capacity of 10 billion cubic meters of gas, the pipeline can bring gas from the fields on the Norwegian continental shelf and contribute to strengthening energy security in southern Scandinavia, Poland and other countries in the region. President, you have been working hard for this day for many years. The first idea of building a gas pipeline appeared in 1991 under the government of Jerzy Buzek. The first contracts were signed. However, in 2003, under the Leszek Miller government, they were cancelled. The concept was revisited in 2005 when law and justice came to power. However, under the Civic Platform government, the concept was left behind. Then came the Civic Platform government, which again abandoned and neglected this project and put it aside. The words that maybe we won't need this Norwegian gas because we have Russian gas after all, and attempts to type with Russian gas until a year, as we know today, from documents, until 2045, sound in our ears today. And again, the time came, the good time of implementing this project in 2016 to 2017. The government of Prime Minister Beata Szydło, and later my government, which implemented this project under the leadership of Minister Piotr Nemski. I would especially like to thank him as well from this place. Piotr, without you, there would be no project. We thank you very much. Rząd pani premier Beaty Szydło i później mój rząd. Otwarcie gazociągu Baltic Pipe powstał. The opening of the Baltic Pipe pipeline came about through cooperation with the Danish and Norwegian governments. This is a historic day for the energy security of Central and Eastern Europe, and the pumping station here near Goleniów is becoming, in a certain way, the vibrant heart of Poland that will deliver gas to our homes. Gas do naszych domów.